Anybody want to guess what's happening here? What's happening with the ice on Timber Lake is it's springtime, almost summer. And so the ice is beginning to crack. And when the ice cracks and expands, it creates that kind of sound. When I first began recording wild soundscapes 45 years ago, I had no idea that ants, insect larvae, sea anemones, and viruses created a sound signature. But they do. And so does every wild habitat on the planet. We've got uh, light rain here, and uh, we've got uh, some clouds, actually some low clouds over in some of the passes, and maybe some snow. But um, it's, it's very squally over here. I think this kind of work is very important as an aspect of preservation of habitats. The soundscape is the voice of a living habitat, and, uh, and to the extent that it connects with the uh, perspective of the health of that habitat, is what's so critical. For if we listen, our ears tell us that the whisper of every leaf and creature speaks to the very sources of our lives. <laughs> 